Sauron is my enemy as much as yours. I can help you destroy him. Wow, your background. Oh, thank you. I'll jump right in with a question for Daniel. Um, the wizards of Middle Earth have such a, a rich legacy on screen with actors like Ian McKellen and Christopher Lee playing them. So how does it feel to get to expand the role of the stranger in season two and really uh, take a big part of that legacy? Yeah, it's, it's funny because I, I still feel like when we started, I didn't really know where the character was going or, in fact, that it was going to be a wizard. And so because that was my starting point, I've never really felt like I've got that pressure of having to uh, portray you know, a wizard or be in those people's league. And I think probably that's quite a useful thing to try and stay, you know, to stay <laughs> and not to think too much about those people because they're massively esteemed actors and, you know, I'm relatively... You know, unknown. So I think I'll just stick with playing playing the present stuff. If it turns out that he's a he's a wizard and he does some things, and find hopefully if I can stay true to the story, then and it, that that can connect with an audience, then then that's as as good as I can do. And uh, Markella and Megan, you play uh, Nori and Poppy, the two Harfoots in Rings of Power, and I loved your kind of uh, dynamic duo style relationship in season one. And I'd love for both of you to talk about how that relationship grows in season two. And even if you see yourself more as like a Frodo and Sam or like a Merry and Pippin style. Uh, I would say I would say that the consistent thing about their friendship in both season one and two is that they really love each other and they really care um, about each other. And I think that the focus, you know, their friendship was also kind of a result of their circumstances and what they'd gone through as young half So I think that also brought them together in a way that is very specific to their friendship. Um, mm -hmm. And so just focusing on that and how their friendship evolves um, has is what I think roots me as uh, Nori. Um, and, and yeah, seeing, seeing how their friendship will be tested and strengthened over time. And Megan? Yeah. <laughs> well, she said it so eloquently, I don't really know if there's any more to add. Um, I think what's also lovely is that no matter what happens, they always know how to bring each other up. Um, mm -hmm. And that's there's something so wonderful about that. But it's not putting anyone on a pedestal. It's yeah. literally just uplifting. Um, and it's something that I think is so... Ne well, it's necessary, especially in their circumstances, what else have they got? But also, I think that's also just such a wonderful thing to see on screen. And it was a wonderful thing, a very easy thing to play, too, with Markella. I think the Nori and Poppy relationship is so unique. I feel like people are going to talk about it, you know, it's, it stands alone. I think that what you've created is really, it's standalone. People will talk about Nori and Poppy and want to be those two friends. It's great. Oh, yeah. yeah, I really love their dynamic on screen. Um, and just Daniel, they're obviously a touch on your character again. There's been so many wild theories about who the stranger really is. Is there a particular theory that you really like or you find outrageous? <laughs> I mean, there, there are some outrageous ones. Yeah, I mean, I, um, I, I sort of feel like, I don't know, that I really like. Have I, you I, seen any of them? Well, tell me some. Oh, no, I haven't. I'm just wondering. I, I mean, I, I, know, I know that there are, you know, I've, I've, I've seen lots of different things, um, but, I, but I think that, I think that for me, the, the exciting thing is is sort of ploughing on with the stories that I get that sort of land on my iPad, and my not knowing where he's going next is sort of the the funnest bit of my job, really. Just playing playing what comes in, working with extraordinary people, and uh, and seeing where it leads. Mm. 